Shea Bear 1000 here. Today I'm going to do a Mountain House review. Another one, lasagna with meat sauce. Monkey's over here, she's going to do one too. So she'll be um, joining, joining us momentarily. Stay tuned, let's see how it tastes. Okay guys, like I said, Monkey is doing her video as well for her channel with the other cameras. So we're kind of doing two at the same time. So here, I'm going to show you the facts on here. If you guys want to look at that, you can pause it and get this focus. You want to show me yours? Or? Yeah, I'm going to show you the facts. I have nutrition facts. So if anybody's interested in eating these, they can read about it first. And they can decide if they like them or not. Yeah, they're all pretty much the same um, lasagna with meat sauce. I got the same thing as she does. Mm -hmm. We're both doing the lasagna meat sauce. Yep. Neither one of us has tried it. So um, you just open the package. You know, there's a tear point right there. Yep. Now tear it open right here. And, and you're going to remove and discard the oxygen absorber from the pouch. Yes. Make sure you don't eat that. Yeah. You carefully add two cups of water, which is 16 ounces of boiling water to the couch, which you can probably hear over there. Mm -hmm. Well, they can see it in mine. Um, our water's ready. All right. Then you just stir thoroughly and close zipper, and you let it stand for eight to nine minutes. Yep. So, let's go ahead and open these up. Alrighty. I'm going to bring it down a little bit. Ooh, smells like it was in there. Uh, yeah. Okay, see that in there. There's that. Tear this open. I'm going to grab the water. And here we go. And I'm going to take my little thingy out so I don't forget. And Which I did not do. Thank oh, you yeah. for reminding me. Oh, it does smell like lasagna. Uh -oh. Did you eat it already? Oh, mine's way down in there. It's usually yeah, right mine on the was top. right up on the top. It usually is. So. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. show a piece of this. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. It uh, looks good. And it smells good. Mmm. Yummy. I'm ready to eat now. Alright, so I don't put a whole two cups in mine because I like it thicker. So let me grab a measuring cup. Okay. But uh, I'm going to just measure mine out to about a cup and three, a cup and a half to a cup and three quarters. Okay. He's pouring in water in his measuring cup. I'm just going to go about a cup and two thirds. Okay. And I'm going to dump mine in. Here's your, do you want to measure yours? Or? Yes, I'll okay. want to. She's going to measure hers as well. Let me get this dumped mm -hmm. in here. You just dump it in and stir it up. Okay. okay. Let me get this dumped in here for her. How much you want? What you said. You just you like yours a little thicker too? Yeah, I don't like it watery. Mm -mm. So that came out of just about perfect. So okay. she's going to dump hers in while Ooh, I'm stirring mine up. So I'm going to show you that's how much we're going to pour in here. And pour just give it a good stir. You know, it smells like real lasagna. Yeah, it does. Doesn't of course, it? nothing like this is going to be, gonna you know, like homemade. But Let's keep stirring it up. There you go. Get it nice and stirred, real good. I usually I just show you guys this, but she got us plates and forks out. She wants us to dump them out. I put so. plates out. Make so it that's fancy. what we'll do here in about eight to nine minutes. And I just dropped it on the white table thing. Mm. Well, that's cheese. Yeah, look at it. It's really, mm. really good. Okay, so now we have to close it up, right? Mm hmm. So we're going to close this little doodad up, and it is hot. Hot, hot, hot. And I'll be back with you guys eight to nine minutes. Okay, guys, I'm back. We're back, and the timer just went off. So we had it set for eight minutes. 
But by the time we got the cameras turned on and everything, it's been about nine minutes. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to dump mine here this on the plate. This is what it looks like inside, if you can see it. I kind of want to show you. There you go. And I'm going to dump it out on my plate. I'm going to bring the camera down a little bit so you can see my you plate. You need to loosen this when you do that. Okay. A little bit of the camera. There we go. Oh, that'll work. Okay. All right, so here we go. Pour it all in here. Ooh, you get quite a bit in here, don't you? Well, you need to stir yours up more. Yeah. Cause see, they're on the edges. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're supposed to stir it up real good. Yeah. Before you zip it up, and then. That's fine. And then, of course, you stir it up again after. Yeah, and then you can stir it up in your plate a little bit. That's what I said after. Yeah. It looks good, doesn't it? That it looks smells really good. good. Mm hmm. It does. This smells really good. And we're going to give it a stir. Yeah. I'm going to try it first without any seasoning. Mm, it does look like mine. It's got more than yours. Maybe yeah, it's because no, I spread it out. It's the same. Should be about the same. Yeah. But. Hmm. Yeah. Looks yummy. Man, that, that is cheesy. Mm hmm. Looks really good. All and right. very hot. Yes, it is very hot. So mm -hmm. I'm going to get you up here. I'm going to yeah. taste this. Yeah. Bring that up. There we go. Very, very warm. Yeah, it's really steaming hot. Okay, it's good. Yeah? Mm-hmm. It tastes like... Now, you know, it doesn't taste like homemade, of course. Nothing does, right? But, um... I would say it's right up there with the... With, like, the frozen ones you get that are really good. I would put it up there with that. Uh, I'll give this a 6 on my rating, 6 to 7. Uh, I figure it would be a 7 by the time I put my seasoning on it. Yeah. But, um, so yeah, that's, uh... Yeah, that's good. Mm-hmm. Very good. Mm-hmm. Cheese is good. I like it. There's some meat, cheese, you can taste the noodles, the meat, cheese. There's, um tomatoes in here you can taste pieces of tomatoes not mm -hmm. just the flavor but there are pieces of tomatoes in here and pieces of meat so yeah mm -hmm. not bad there's uh i think there's some onions in here too maybe some peppers yeah i think there's some onions i, I taste but a few onions in here there's, I think. A, there's a piece of tomato there's a tomato there's some meat it's um, very good i'm gonna go ahead and give it a seven yeah i mean so yeah I, I like it. So I probably, I I probably say a six. Only reason is because I do like the frozen ones <laughs> than this one. Well, but everybody's it, different. I mean, if you're out camping and you buy these and take them with you, heck, at least you're getting a good meal out in the middle of nowhere. But the price still good. sucks. Price, yeah. price, price to me is, gets a zero. Yeah, very expensive. I think even I think five dollars would be plenty, and that's pushing it. Yeah. I don't I don't think I would go give five dollars for a bag of this, no. Um mm -mm. it's just too expensive. It is way too expensive. Yeah. Very good, but I mean, geez, for nine bucks. It's very expensive. You no. can buy you know you can buy other stuff. That's you can make it yourself. Freeze dried that's if you have a dehydrator. Yeah. But if you don't, just the normal, average, everyday person. That's why I like doing these reviews for people like us mm -hmm. that don't don't have the the thing to do with the dehydrator and all that. Um, there's other things you can buy. I know a lot of people don't like or are getting tired of, but the uh, Top Ramen those are good to take anywhere. Yeah, they're very um, good. <clears throat> there's all all I kinds like, of packages yeah. of free dried freeze dried packages. Uh, food that you can get and, and take with you on a camping trip or a day trip, mostly for hikers, because um, it is light and everything. But it's just nine. It's not nine dollars worth for nine bucks. You can buy mm -mm. a whole bunch of stuff. 
No. So the price just absolutely sucks. Zero. Uh, the product itself is very good. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Alright, so I'm going to yeah. go ahead and season mine up and I'm going to finish my supper. Are you? Yeah. I'm fine. I'll just eat the way it is. You're just going to eat yours the way it is? Mm-hmm. Um, but I'm going to season mine up and I'm going to finish this. And Monkey's going to eat hers the way it is. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, I, I'm, I like it. And it, but I probably <clears throat> would never buy it because of the ex expense. It's just way too expensive. Yeah. Some of the desserts, what did you have? She had a dessert, it was like oh, four something. Ice cream sandwich. Yeah, it was like. It was good. Yeah, but it was like four something still. Yeah. You know, it's like, I, it's it just so steep. expensive. I mean. Yeah. So anyways, guys, I'm going to say I'm out for now. And I hope you have a good rest of the weekend. Um, we're <clears> probably <throat> going to do some selling tomorrow, right? I don't know yet. We're not sure yet. Depends on the day. But I know a lot of you guys will be watching the race, so Trump 2020, it's going to be a badass car. Keep your eye on it. So, yeah. starting out in uh, 18th. So, yeah, there you go. Yep. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Joe Nemechek's driving it. So. It might be a really <clears throat> good race. Oh, it's going to be a good race. You know Trump's going to be there. But anyway, so, <laughs> like she said, enjoy the rest of your weekend, guys. And we'll chat at you soon. Bye-bye. She bears the mental man legend. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, click the bell icon, get more notifications of more video. Yeah. Like this. Monkey says she's out for now. He said it all. So. Don't forget to check out <laughs> Monkey 1000 channel. She's got some awesome videos, too. So, um, okay. keep an eye out for her. Thanks, guys. We'll see you soon. Bye, y'all.